Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough of sorts. <laughs> I don't know if you can really consider the these party games as sort of a walkthrough because you know, I'm just kind of playing these once just to show them off and that's about it. I mean, there's just so many of these suckers. <laughs> anyway, as you can see by the controls, you hold the A button and then you swing the Wii Remote like so and then release... Huh? I didn't release the button. I swear I didn't release the button. And then release the button when it's in front of you to throw it forward. Oh, well, I guess that wasn't too bad of an attempt. Come on, baby, we can do this! Woo! Yeah, this is another game that works pretty well. Although, uh, it's another extremely linear game, and my best score was 74.27. What? Hmm. And that was a really bad throw. <laughs> Maybe the first time that I played this, it I didn't go back to it because it was linear. And why didn't I go all that far? I was swinging it. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> like, it was one of those things that I played only once, and I only got one into the field, and the rest of them were fouls, as I demonstrated three times there. And uh, that is seriously a first place rank? You have got to be kidding me. Well, what, what are the... 60 was third? Wow. <laughs> that That's a surprisingly easy game to get uh, first on. <laughs> Alright, high wire act. I believe you just tilt the Wii Remote to balance of sorts. I really hope this one works. I don't remember if this one works or not. Um, but yeah, tilt forward to move forward and left and right to... Mo well, balance. Eh, eh, eh. Oh yeah, this one works. Works quite well, I must say. It doesn't appear to be any sort of wind or things getting thro- What? Why did I fall there? I was pointed straight up and down, wasn't I? I wasn't leaning towards any side. Was I like going too fast or something like that? Let's try that again. <laughs> I don't get why I fell off there, honestly. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Alright, baby robo. Let's do this. Actually, I'm. Looks like some sort of baby robo of sorts, but I don't know. Why? I don't get why I fell off that other time. I was I was going at, a, at the right pace, and no, 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 no. No, no, no. It's okay, baby. We've, we've got this. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't go too fast. I seem to be doing a little better here. Yeah, I think if you go too fast, that's that's what kind of kicks you off. Like if you, whoa, like if you're running, and otherwise it's pretty easy to get there. <laughs> I guess the trick of this mini game, that despite it being uh, very very linear, is the fact that you have to try and maintain a speed without going and getting too wobbly like that so that you can get there in the shortest amount of time possible and back of course no 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 it's okay we we just carefully we carefully move forward no 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 slow down it's okay we just can't let the wire wobble just carefully yes why is it so much wob more wobbly than the first one. Is it because it's a longer rope and it's higher up or, or something like that? i not sure, actually. <laughs> Don't get thrown off. We're, we're nearly there. I know, I know, but I'm not gonna hurry up. <laughs> you can't tempt me to dash forward, man. Yay! Indeedly do. It was a success. Yeah, this game works well. Just another pretty boring game <laughs> unfortunately next one home oh, I'm, oh, I've never played this one before so this is a first time experience it is a blind run of sorts and that's pretty easy <laughs> all right looks like I won't need ye old nunchuck here 
Just make sure I don't have it on so I don't whip it in, like against the camera or something like that. Alright. And I was practicing way too much there. Alright. A little late. Watch the arm, PK Gam. Wow, I, I, I am apparently very bad at baseball. <laughs> I'm gonna have to try this again because this is my first play and all. Uh, okay. Wait, how many how many shots do I, I should say, how many throws do I get anyway? I do not know. This is going really, really, really quickly. <laughs> it seems like it's very, very sensitive. Like, it swings if you ever, twitch ever so slightly. <laughs> okay, 10 swings, huh? Okay, I'm going to try this one more time. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I highly doubt that's enough to get into the higher, yeah, high score rankings there. Um, yeah, this game goes really, really fast. <laughs> All right, we're gonna knock some out of the park this time, or not. <laughs> Clearly, my timing is off. Or I'm not swinging hard enough to get the angle needed, or I should say the height needed, to get some more distance on these. <laughs> but it didn't, like, really show. Finally! A home run! It didn't really show on the controls if, like, if, like, angle or something, or velocity of your swing mattered at all. I assume it does. What I'm doing is, like, swinging at an upward 45 degree angle forward. And, yeah, that seems to be working. <laughs> Looks like it only took me two tries to get the hang of this minigame. <laughs> yeah, baby! Well, I should say two plays to get the hang of the game. Not too shabby, I have to say. So, what does it only count your best swing and not your total amount of feet or something like that? Hmm. It's kind of odd, if you ask me. And second rank! <laughs> Never gets old. <clears throat> Alright, next mini game. Which is the hover... Oh no, please don't tell me it is like the um, alien attack one. It is... No! Why? Okay, so to boost, you swing both of them forward. And... Did I ever play this one before? Just for the heck of it. No, I never played it before. <laughs> I'm pretty, pretty sure that this game is in the game's demo, too. Oh, no! Alright. Yeah! I bet you I have to, like, knock them around with that boost or something like that. Alright, turn, please. And yeah, it feels exactly like the alien attack one. And that's not a good feeling. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh, someone must have used an item. And it stull or stuns you or something like that. Alright, boost! Uh-huh. I got no points for that, so I have no idea what I am supposed to do! <laughs> Um, this is like super slippery craziness here. I actually lose points when I use a boost? Well, how the heck do you get points? Like, how did the green computer there get points? <laughs> I, have no, I have no idea. And this is a three minute match, oh my goodness, this, and it's going nowhere! <laughs> Wait, I would like to see what that W is. That's probably an item. But I, I, was, I was nowhere near it, so there was no way I could have gotten that. Um, yeah, it looks like you need the items to get points, but... Where... I mean, how in the world do you manage to... Be at the right place at the right time? And that didn't give me any points, despite hitting them... Hitting him while I was... Stunning everyone at this. I, I have no idea and who got that W that that, that W was clearly not collected by me 
Yeah, boosts do absolutely not. What? <laughs> how, did, how did the blue and yellow computer even get points at one time anyway? Are you supposed to knock them into things? Ah, I guess you are supposed to knock them into things. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. No. Um. Did I misread something in the game's, like, controls or, like, rules or something like that? Because I'm, I am greatly confused. <laughs> no, I would like to knock you into that the bumper, not into the wall. <laughs> oh, I'm frozen, and I really don't want to play this game a second time to figure out everything, honestly. <laughs> um, I guess it's not that bad. How did I get a thousand points there? What? Yeah, I, I'm not, I don't get this at all, because I can bump right into them directly like that, but if I nick them on the side, or if I hit them into something, it sometimes gets gives me points. <laughs> are you are you following this? I, I'm, I'm not getting this myself. <laughs> and I'm happy the game is over. <laughs> I'm just going to hide here until... Yeah, and I, I'm still moving moving forward somehow. Somehow I managed second place. I am proud of this. <laughs> Even though I don't know how I managed to get points. Game over. <laughs> I'm, I'm just gonna check that one more time. Like, I'm gonna check the controls. I'm not gonna play the game, I'm just gonna check the controls. Eh, eh, eh. It says... Move the hovercraft to bump bump into the enemy's rear end. Oh, so I was hitting them... So whenever I got points, I was hitting them from the back? That didn't look like it to me. <laughs> Did it? Alright, hovercraft race. I'm sure it's the exact same controls. <laughs> Oh no, there's three courses! No! Have mercy! <laughs> Alright, looks like I'm gonna have to do all three. Do I... Oh, wait, should I have checked to see if I'm supposed to go around these flags or not? Wait, I, I should probably check that first. I, I just looked at the controls and I didn't really look at the rules. Hmm... Collect the flags by bumping into them. Oh, so you just hit the flags and that's it. Okay. Yeah, I really should just pay attention to all these controls here. Uh, mm -hmm. What about that middle one? It says two out of three. The other ones are two out of two. Okay. <laughs> it's just to move backward and that was kind of obvious. Alright, easy course. You better be easy. I have faith that you are going to be much harder than you need to be. <laughs> okay, maybe this isn't that hard. Though it is pretty slippery. <laughs> oh my, you really slip around, don't you? No, 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 I want to turn that way. And now move forward to hit the flaggy. There we go, that's how you do it! Oh. oh! And it seems to be based on best time, and that's not based on, like, how f how fast you can collect the flags. Yeah, the hovercraft does work to a point, but it's so slippery. Maybe I should try alien attack again. <laughs> because I, I s sort of got the hang of the hovercraft controls a little more. Uh, come on, drift into the flag. Drift into that flag, please. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I couldn't see where I was aiming, but yeah, anyway. I know where the last one is. It's way over there. Forgot the slipperiness. I should have turned much... A lot ahead of time. Alright, all right, slow, slowly, carefully, there we go. And I feel obligated to do the other two, even though I'm gonna do a lot worse. <laughs> or at least I expect I will, unless I 
get the hang of the hovercraft controls completely. Wow, 40 seconds? I can't see myself doing that anytime soon. <laughs> I mean, for the, you know, number one spot. Number two! Uh, this doesn't really look all that different. <laughs> it's just another circle. It's another, another case of linearness, so to speak. Okay, I just gotta manipulate my hands properly. There we go! It seems to be easier to drift into the flags from the side, I swear. No, wait, let me go backwards. And now... I'd like to... Uh, <laughs> I'd like to get them all, like, in sections, rather than randomly floating around this place, if you know what I mean, to, like, divide and conquer, but wow. Why does hovercrafts have to be so slippery? Do hovercrafts really feel this bad? <laughs> I don't. I, I've never driven a hovercraft before, nor do I think I ever will, so I can't experience that for myself. No, no, stop, 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 no, not go backwards. I mean, can you stop, like, at all? <laughs> as you're going on this, because it seems like that you're either going full throttle one direction or you are um, sliding out of control. <laughs> and that's a slight issue. Eh, 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 drift into it. Oh, wrong direction. Eh, come on. Eh, and you can tell that I am, you know, using thrust on both sides. You can tell by, like, those little wings. Basically, but it seems like they only go at maximum power or bust. <laughs> I swear. All right, oh, we got two in a row there. That's surprising. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Good. I think I am getting the hang of this. Get it flaggy. No. Hey, why are the flags I I? I'm playing as baby. <laughs> One more. <laughs> Two minutes and ten seconds just to collect fifteen flags. <laughs> I think I could get that down if I practiced it, but it's another one of those things where I just don't feel like it. <laughs> The game is just too boring to warrant me to practice it. Alright, 16 flags this time, and I already missed one! Maybe I should try aiming off to the side of a flag rather than trying to aim directly for one. Because I clearly cannot aim towards a flag. <laughs> I was trying to, like, wiggle myself to keep myself straight that time, like to cause a drift or something like that, but that apparently does not work in the slightest. Mm. Okay, I'm going to attempt to beat that record up there. Okay, I'm not really. <laughs> I'm just joking around here, because you can still see that I am clearly flailing around here. Drift into the flag! Yeah, drifting into them does seem to work a lot better for me, at least, rather than hitting them directly. Alright, so maybe it's because I like slow down when I turn. As I explained before with the hovercraft, it seems when you turn it, you lose speed. So you also kind of lose your direction uh, that you want to turn. That's a, in case you don't realize that. <laughs> That's what I explained way back at the alien attack. Man, I keep referencing that game a lot. <laughs> Okay, drift, drift, or, no, said drift. Drift the way that I want you to go. <laughs> this is why I want to divide and conquer the flags, as you've seen, like, those remaining four were all in the same area. That way I don't have to keep bouncing around from place to place. You know, these courses, as they call them courses, they don't really seem all that different. <laughs> I mean, there's some bouncy cones, you know, colored cones, and you got the flags, which are just place there seemingly. They don't seem to be in, in any sort of pattern of sorts. 
They're just there, and you just bump into them like a, um, a bumper car rally. Like you're trying to bump into other players, only they're stationary. Well, I'm glad that's over. <laughs> um, I think I'll do one more mini game if it's a short one. I did not make it into a high scoreboard on any of them. Um, hurdle race. This sounds like it'll be quick. <laughs> Run, alternate those critters, and then press the B button to jump. Okay, this looks like it's going to work well. I have faith that this is going to work well. Alright, shaky, 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 shaky. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's working well, baby. And uh, uh, it's the, the cord of the Wii Remote and Nunchuck, well, it's actually just the Nunchuck, is tapping on the chair that's in, up in front of my face to put the microphone of the camera closer to my face. <laughs> and that was a first place run that also beat the high score. That was another game that turned out to be ridiculously linear. <laughs> There's just no depth to them. That makes me sad. <laughs> okay, that was a really short game. Maybe I'll do one more if it's if it's short enough. Like if if they had like moving hurdles or maybe added some random treadmills or something like that onto the track and made it longer, it would have been more interesting. Oh no, I'm not going to be able to get through jigsaw puzzles in this part. <laughs> so I'm going to end it here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.